Hello, my name is Yasley Duarte. Dean Jefferson faced many challenges growing up that could potentially be the reasons for the murders that he committed throughout his life. Biological data. When it comes to Keith Jefferson, he was known to be the happy face serial killer because he drew smiley faces on many letters to the media and prosecutor in which he boasted about his crimes. He was physically abused by his father. Jefferson was often punished, beaten with leather belts, and sometimes his father would shock him with electric fences. His father was a domineering alcoholic and drug addict. Jefferson's father was a hardworking man. But this does not mean that he was perfect. As a child, Jefferson was treated as an outcast by his family, and he was teased by many other children due to his physical appearance. This would give him nicknames like Igor. This caused him to be a troublesome child, and he intended to kill these children that would bully him. He was given less attention to from his other uh, siblings, and he was treated very differently. Like no one liked them, it caused him to be very violent towards animals, which caused him to become a serial killer. Keith Jefferson founded a hobby to torture animals and kill them. He would now cow to boards and he would throw knives at them. His favorite thing to do was to crimp a couple cat's tails together, wire them, and throw them over a rope. The sociological data. After Jefferson graduated high school, his dream was to work as a Canadian Royal uh, Mounted Police Officer. But sadly, during his training as a police officer, he fell during the training exercise and he injured himself, and which led to a permanent dismiss. This led him to become a truck driver in Cheney, Washington. Jefferson murdered a total of eight women in the states of Nebraska, California, Florida, Washington, Oregon, and Wyoming. As he was a truck driver at the time he committed these murders. He is now serving two life terms for murdering of individuals in Wyoming and Oregon. But after being married to Rose for 14 years and after having a beautiful child, um, Rose and her child decided to move to a different state that was more than 200 miles away. Obviously, like it was a long distance relationship, Jefferson and Rose decided to obtain a divorce in 1990. Psychological data. Keith Jefferson was an antisocial person. He was diagnosed with antisocial personality disorder. Keith Jefferson was obsessed with raping most of his victims and he also strangled them. He even left a note on one of the Groundhound buses that stated, I killed Tona Bennett in January 21st, 1990 in Portland, Oregon. I beat her to death, raped her, and loved it. He then signed the note placing a happy face right next to it. This showed how he did not have any type of remorse. He is sick in the head, and whenever he killed his victims, he didn't care about the feelings.